Okay. So can you tell me a wee bit about the process? Um, started off with uh, VAO obviously coming out to explain, you know, the whole thing. And then as the organisation on the island that usually deals with that type of thing, um, ED Partnership got involved to start the ball rolling and facilitate the process. Um, at that point we took a step back once the community formed their own you know, steering group because we were quite keen we wanted to get people who weren't the usual suspects mm, yeah. you know, involved. So we wanted people to come forward who weren't involved in any of the traditional you know, groups and, and carry that forward by themselves. And what, tell me a wee bit about the, some of the ideas that came forward and how those, those developed. Um, there was quite a few ideas. I think the ones that were supported were some activities and um, some benches. Uh, the benches are going to be made as an activity, I think. You know, so it's somebody on the island who's mm. you know, involved in that because there's quite a strong ethos of keeping stuff uh, on the island. Good. And what did you think about the voting process? Um, it's quite difficult for a small island. I mean, it made us think. So, what age groups we were working with? So we went from uh, from about eight, you know, up. So we yeah. involved, you know, even the younger children on the island. We had some of the younger children making the decisions, you know, as well. Um, as it turned out, the amount of projects we had, we could do them all, you know, with the okay. money. So the vote was um, it was more of a, a rubber stamping, you know, exercise. But it was quite nice because everybody got what they, yes. what they wanted. So. Good. Okay.